what's up, y'all? So, so my job decides to do a, a, a Easter egg hunt. Happy Easter, y'all. Take take this out. Oh, and they're off. Go get it. Brenda. Go. 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 And on the count of three, everybody run off to your fantasy. Go. Oh, yeah. You know what I just spotted, y'all? In the meantime, I will go and grab some candy. Oh, yeah. Catch up with y'all later. Oh, yeah. Look what I got, guys. Look what I got. All right, let me get out of here. Let me get out of here. All right. So I ate about six, seven pieces of chocolate, boy. Woo, I'm all chocolated it up right now, man. Everybody at my job out here lollygagging and searching for eggs and playing around. I figure I'll take this time to give you guys my top five Patreons. My top five Patreon uh, albums that I've listened to. So um, I'm going to take these lame glasses off. Hold on, let me, let me run to the booth real quick and transform into YouTube mode. Come on. All right, I'm ready, guys. I got my shades on. Let's do this, man. So, uh, top five Patreon. Appreciate it, guys. Thanks for sending me all your requests. I've had some time to sit down and uh, listen to all these things at my desk. I've had some time to listen to all these things while I'm walking the neighborhood, getting my little neighborhood exercise on. I think I'm ready to give you guys my top five Patreon. So, here we go. Come on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Ugh, can't get the same no more when you're grown. I don't like hard candy like that. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. When I was younger, right now, crunching into something like that. Mm -mm. All right, where, where were we? Coming in at number five, Rob Zombie. Coming in at number four. August Burns Red. So yeah, man, that's my top five. That's my top five patrons. Thank you guys for sending them in. Keep sending them bad boys in right there, man. Uh, there were a lot of uh, good uh, honorable mentions I can mention throw in that bad boy. Uh, I can make a top 10 list real easy. Uh, there was a couple of shock value guys in here that I didn't mention, like uh, like like the, uh, uh, what, what was that? Uh, uh, the car bomb and um, uh, the Ice-T band, uh, you know, real epic albums like that, uh, really strong shock value. Those could easily be uh, top 10 right there, but I just had to pick the top five that I've been coming back to the most. And uh, I seem to like that 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 flavor right there, that ACDC 
uh, flavor. I, I don't know why that type of music has grown on me. And that's what's so beautiful about this whole thing. I had a blank canvas and I've listened to all these different types of different genres and subgenres of metal. And, and it just, and, and as, as more and more hit on me, you, you start to get an idea of what flavor uh, lands on me the most. And that whole uh, British uh, uh, ACDC sound right there, that, 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 you know, that, ah, that gasoline, ah, when they hit them notes like that, and they hit them, ah, <laughs> I don't know what it is about that sound, man. And that and that pitch of voice and, and the cleanness of the, the crispness of the drums echoing and stuff like that, man. That stuff moves me more than the uh than the growling type and the screaming type and the machine gun drumming and all, all that. Nah, I mean, just go and give me the organic sound and stuff right there with some good old clean echoing vocals and stuff like that, man. That stuff just seems to land on me a little more. But I'm still open-minded to a lot more subgenres that I haven't gotten into. But uh, as far as the top five that I've been coming back to the most those are the ones right there uh, Rob Zombie uh, I like the uh, industrial uh, outside the box sound of it. it it doesn't necessarily sound so much like uh, metal uh, also uh, oh another honorable mention is that mr. bugle that was another sh uh, 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 shocker right there uh, but back back to what I was saying uh, number four was uh, August Burns Red uh, the drumming on that bad boy uh, was fantastic. Fantastic drummer. Number three. What was number three? Number three was uh, 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 uh. number three was Striker. Striker. Love that sound. So again, a Striker, uh, Virgin Steel, uh, Airborne. They all, all three of those two are have the same kind of uh sound they're all related with that sound and i can't quite put my finger on it you guys can tell me what subgenre striker uh airborne and virgin steel fall under and uh I, it's just something about that sound guys that, that i'm really re replaying i'm coming back to that sound a lot when i'm out and about and i'm walking the neighborhoods i'm coming back to that sound when i'm playing music out loud in public and I got people in the car with me. I'm coming back to that sound. It lands much better than the screaming type. It, it lands much better than the shock value ones. It lands much better than like that Ice T uh, uh, album. It's 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 angry, and I'm not always going to be in the mood for that. The Mr. Bugle. It's I'm not always going to be in the mood for that for that craziness. Uh, the uh, the uh, the car bomb. I'm not always going to be in the mood for that that craziness. Those are shock value albums one time, or I'm specifically in the mood for it, and I'm gonna go to it. But as far as me just leisurely, daily, day to day, riding around in my car, I'm listening to to the Striker. I'm listening to the the. The, the Airborns, I'm listening to the Virgin Steels. I'm listening to the ACDCs. I'm listening to the Iron Maidens. I'm listening to the Judas Priest. That that sound resonates with me when I'm riding around and I'm just, you know, just doing random things throughout the day. So uh, you guys are going to tell me what subgenre that is right there. And I'm definitely open to more subgenres. But as I've been going through this journey, guys, and listening to so many different types of metal uh, I think I've kind of turned into that category. I'm, I'm leaning into, I've, I've landed into that category of metal right there. So for you guys who, uh, whose subgenre of metal is, is that uh, category that I'm talking about, is your number one. I, I think I'm leaning towards that being my number one subgenre of metal too. And then I got the other tiers and the other layers. Uh, but yeah, man, you guys saw my reaction. Uh, thank you guys for sending in all your Patreons. Keep sending them bad boys. And I can't wait for the next round. All right, man. Till next time. Ow. This is right here. This, this is who I am, guys. This is who I am. Alright.
Ich stehe auch.